It's the Frank Show. What? The Frank Show. Come on, the Frank Show. What? The Frank Show. Come on, the Frank Show. What? The Frank Show. Come on, the Frank Show. Bitch, it's time for the show. Aloha, heads, heads, it's your boy Frank, and it's time for the Frank Show. Now, I've been hearing a buzz in the community about people facing a black screen of death when playing on the Pro with their PlayStation VR. Now, I think that's terrible. I've never faced this issue, but if you have faced this issue, I think I may have found a solution, and if not an end or be all, this should definitely get your system and gaming fixed. Now, I reached out, and wonderful community members, as always, gave their input, and we're gonna share it all here, so you'll have a handful of fixes you can try, see if that works, and if not, like I said, we got one, it'll definitely work for you. now. First up, Mandeville, I'm pretty simple right here. Just reset your PS4 Pro. Now, I don't know if you tried this. You may have, you may not have, but they're talking a hard reset. So, I mean, power it all the way down and turn it all the way back on and maybe that'll work for you. Steve Smith says, hey, just turn off your headset for a few seconds. So he's saying just hit the power button on the headset, wait a little while, maybe even unplug it, plug it back in, turn it back on, and see if that solves everything for you. Vin Beasel has a little bit more creative of an option for us. He says to just leave everything on and unplug the TV wire from your Pro, wait a couple seconds for the signal to change, and then plug it back in. Now, like I said, this doesn't affect me, so hey, you can try it out. Noah's to die seems to think it has nothing to do with the Pro whatsoever, and it's just an overheating breakout box. Now, that could be the case, so just make sure that your breakout box isn't just on all day long. Jeff Davies thinks that it's just a faulty HDMI, so maybe try another HDMI. I wouldn't go out and buy one, or I mean, you can, but save your receipt, make sure you can return it, because hey, it could be that. Pete Hewton says, hey, all you gotta do is disable HTCP. If you don't know how to do that, go to your settings, and it's in your little options menu, and it's gonna be the enable and disable, just move that check mark. That really makes it so you can't record any kind of like movies or anything. Most of you never even have to worry about that one. So try that, disable that one, see if it works for you. All right, and Troy Powell on the HTCP level says it turn your PS4 Pro to safe mode, then from safe mode, select the HTCP option, and then from there, all you gotta do is change from the automatic setting to whatever the other one is. He said that thing fixed his. All right, Ryan seems to have that option too and had a different solution than all the rest of us. He said that with the Pro a lot of the time, he got 4K switched on. When he plays PSVR, he turns it to 1080p. He said since he's flipped on a 1080p when on the VR, he has never had a single issue and even told other friends. So hey, that seems like a viable option. Check that one out. And finally, tech for the future has the end all be all for you if you're facing this problem. Now he said he had the issue and you know what he did? He just sent his pro into Sony and he said that they fixed it and since he's gotten it back, no issue whatsoever. So maybe it is an internal error. I have absolutely no idea, but the thing is, as long as you're under warranty, you might as well send it off. He said it only takes a few days. It's not like weeks or months like you're worried about. So hopefully this helps you out. One of these options, now you have a variety of options to try and you got them all in one place. Now, this brings to attention this question that I ask. Another question that was brought up in the community. So, your boy Frankie is here to help. We're going to continue this series and today's question that I pose to all of you is coming from the PSVR Frank and the Headsets PSN community. Now, Jezza like you says that he has had issues with the tilt and his VR since launch. Now, I had a couple issues with launch and I fixed my whole setup where I play. Since then, I've had no problems whatsoever. Now, it could be as simple as that, but maybe he's tried that. Maybe you've tried that. Does anybody have any other solutions other than just the whole not the reflective behind you. Please let me know in a video and we will put together another troubleshooting tips video. Now, thank you all for coming through. You are the most beautiful people on the world. Don't forget to tell yourself you're great every single day because your boy Frankie knows that you are. You should deserve a round of applause, a thumbs up, and if you think I deserve one, then hey, Throw me one as well, but more important than all of that is that if you want to stay up to date on everything PlayStation VR and you don't mind this ugly mug, friggin' subscribe. But I mean, come on. No. Smudges, you beautiful. Another day.